Let me ask you. So you're not cheating? Not cheating and, at all. And, and, and you, it's the third time in uh, 10 years, oh, a little more than 10 years, it's the third time that I didn't had to take a lot of take the test, and I'm hoping that we can get everything settled today. It must get old after a while it's, of it's, being constantly accused of something that you're not doing. It's exhausting at times. It's nerve-wracking at times. Uh, sometimes I just, I don't know what to do. She calls me a whore. She calls you a whore? She calls me a bitch. Uh, she calls you a bitch? Yeah. She called me a stupid ass. You know, sometimes <laughs> I might say this back to her. I might tolerate. She might call me a bitch five times. <laughs> then I might say it one time to her. Well, you should never I, say if it. If I say it to her, yeah. then I, my one time... <laughs> my one time to her is way yeah, more than all the times she say When to you me. say that word, you're just begging for a fight, you right. know? We were separated for about 10 months, and we got back together. Why were you separated? Uh, this same kind of stuff. It got, it, got so, it got so bad. When we got back together now, she told me that back then, she cheated on me several times with somebody. Back then, she told me that since we've been together now to hurt me. You know, and, and I and told it, her. And it does hurt. I, but I told her at the same time, because of I, I love her so much and because we have established more together financially and we have two kids now that we're raising, small kids that right. we're raising, that there was a past relationship. And the past is the past. That I let that go and say that we can be together now as long as you're not doing that now. I'm just being told that after that 10-month breakup, while you were apart, she actually got pregnant by another man. Yeah. And you're, and you're raising that child. Yeah, the, the child that uh, she got pregnant with when we were separated for those 10 months, we got back together. Uh, she was about five months pregnant. And uh, I, I loved her, you know, and I accepted it. She's been raised as So dope. you're dead. I'm hers, yes. You're dead. And, and I, she's my daughter. Um, very good. <laughs> what if she comes out here and she fails this lie detector test? Don't know. <laughs> I, you know what? I'm hoping. Uh, I hope she passes. You got two little kids you're raising, and you know when you go through that, it sucks. It's it's a hard thing to go when you love somebody and and you know they betray you like that. Um, your wife's name is Willie. Let's bring her out. Took two you are a you out here trying to make me look like no, a damn fool. No, I'm not making you look like no yes, fool. I'm, you are. I'm telling the truth. You, you're telling I the truth. I have taken two you don't flirt. You I don't flirt. flirt. You if somebody, flirt. if somebody look at me when I'm walking behind you, that's not flirt. No, you don't look. You stare. If I see you eyeballing another female and I'm standing right there, how you think that make me feel? I don't be eyeballing nobody else. I'm so not, I'm, I, I'm actually crazy, no, right? you are mistaken. I passed two tests to say that and I'm not having no is. kind of contact with nobody at all. Period. Please. Uh, I uh, see. Willie, hi, Willie. Um, <laughs> what if it, what if what if he did look at a female? No, no, you don't look. I don't care if he looks. I look at other men. You do not stare so, uh, at other females. Um, That's disrespectful. We can I, this as I just told you. We can be riding down the street. Now oh, can please. I can I stare? Can I stare while I'm driving? Yes. We're going to wreck this. Yes. Steve, <laughs> if, I'm staring if we while go I'm to driving, the grocery we're gonna store. Come on, man. We're going to wreck. That's proof. That's proof. Listen. You got to tell me, okay? Mm -hmm. The guy comes out. He seems like one of the nicest guys that's ever he been on my be. stage. Does he treat you good? Sometimes. And how does, how does he <laughs> not treat you good? Disrespect. But not Control. Let me finish. Okay. Control. I can't go anywhere without this man. I can't do anything. I, I'm looking at somebody that likes to be in control. No. That's, <laughs> how you gonna jump? Oh, come on. Come on. I, um, wow. Do you, he says that. Hey. I'm, I'm only doing the show, okay? I'm just asking wow. the questions like I'm supposed to. Um, you call him names? I have. He's called me names as well. He's admitted that. Mm -hmm. He says after you call him 
bitch five or six times. That's a lie. No, that's true. Oh, my God. That's true. Sometimes I don't have to say nothing. Sometimes she can just think about something from the past. <laughs> we, can, we can be lovey-dovey, just finished making love. We go to work. She think about something from the past. I can't touch her. I can't kiss her. Mm -hmm. She say this stuff in front of the kids, make them look at me in a I funny don't do way. I do that anymore. She say, she's told her parents. She's told her sister. She's accused me of having sex with family members of hers. We're okay. talking about things that happened decades yeah, ago. Yeah, decades before, ago. This happened... But same thing with him. No, this happened before we got okay, married. Okay, hold on. Steve. Okay, but please, can I do my show? Do your okay. show. Listen. Um, he talks about hey, there was a time when you split up for 10 months mm -hmm. and you got pregnant with another guy. Okay, we weren't together. Yeah, but you go back with him, right? Yes. And he says, I'm going to accept this child, he, and he's very good to the child, right? Wonderful. Wonderful. Okay, maybe I'm seeing something that everybody else, are, are you guys seeing something I'm not seeing? No! no. So, I have to ask you, are you cheating? Yeah. Find out. Find out. Read the results and you'll see. But I want to hear it from you. No. No what? I have nothing else to say. Read the results. That's what you do. Okay. I will. I will listen. If you want to tell your story on the Steve Wilco Show, visit the link in the description to get my help. Do you want to make things work with him? I wouldn't be here if I did. But, okay, so how about explaining something that you like about him? I haven't had the chance. Well, it's all yours. He's a good man. Okay, now, and see, like, I could see the, what you're saying, and you're getting choked up talking about that. Could some of that frustration, could that be causing you to take it out on him? Maybe, because he's not there like he's supposed to be. Well, I, I don't... work a lot. I, right, and I'm not going to get into that because only you know, and I can't comment on that, but he's saying he's working, he's saying he he, he's, he, he's... He doesn't work that much. She works with me. He I take some of the load off Does, of does he work enough to support you? Yes. Okay, well, I mean, what's the guy doing wrong? It doesn't... To me, you got a guy that works, that says he loves you, cries about you, accepts all your faults, doesn't yell at you from what I'm just seeing right here. Maybe he goes home and this is just a we big show. Right, he, he submitted that. Fussed, but I try but to the be point, more you control. love her, right? You're yeah, not I lying about that. Death. And you want to stay with her? I want to spend forever. the rest of my life with her. So you're even making the effort there? Yes, sir. Okay. Um, it's not a big effort. You know what? I kind of get the feeling that no matter what... Look, you're going to defend him regardless. No, I'm saying... What it seems... I'm going to say what I need to say because I need him. You're going to stay here. But you here. came on my show I for need something, him. and I, I want to know what that's about. And I need him to stand up and do what he needs to do. Like I said I earlier, see the this guy standing isn't right a here. joke. It's not, I'm not trying to make it a joke. Okay, well, but, come, I go, well, let's, but how let's many get hoops does it. he have to jump through? As many as I need him to jump oh. through to get what the job done. Okay. You know what? I'm trying to be sympathetic to your problems. Right. I'm sure you are. I am. I am. <laughs> I said, I like your husband more than I've liked a lot of people that have been on my stage. I see, he seems like... <laughs> guy seems like a solid guy, man. And if that's not good enough, maybe you need to find somebody that can fulfill everything that he's not. <laughs> Edward, you took a lie detector test. You want the can results? Can you read mine first, please? You can. I'll if ask. That's not a I'll ask my wife if I can do that. Okay, honey, can I do that? Yeah. No, she said no. Everybody's on your side. See, I take orders too. She nice. said no. Edward, you took a lie detector test before the show. Yes, sir. And you were asked, <laughs> since your last polygraph, have you had any type of sex sexual physical contact with a woman other than Willie? You said no. Since your last polygraph, have you had sexual intercourse with a woman other than Willie? You said no. Since you've been married to Willie, 
Have you had any type of sexual, physical contact with another woman? You said no. Since married, have you had sexual intercourse with a woman other than Willie? And you answer no. And the results for his third polygraph, first one on the Steve Wilco show, but he did take two here, and he passed both of them. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. See, I told you. I told you. Ain't nobody else. Ain't nobody else. Never been nobody else. Where's the joyous expression? See, this where's, the third one. where's the happiness? I'm pissed. Why are you pissed? Because. This is the third time. Because I'm on the show like I'm the bad guy when he knows better. No, we just Who called the show? I did. OK. Can you get to my results, Steve? Thank yes, you. I can. Thank you. Do you, do, you, do you like me? I don't anymore. <laughs> I lost one viewer. Oh, no, I'm still going to watch. I just oh, okay. don't like There you go. <laughs> That's all I care about. All right. Willie, since you've been married, have you had any type of sexual, physical contact with another man besides Edward? You answered no. Since you've been married, have you had sexual intercourse with another man besides Edward? And you answered no. And the results for your lie detector test is that you told the Thank truth. You. Thank you. <laughs> So, Edward, I hope I've made her so mad at me that she's just going to be so nice to you. Thank you, Steve. OK. Now, Willie, honestly, I'm going to be in your boat someday with the teenagers. And I'm sure it's, I've seen it with other parents with teenagers. It's very frustrating. And it could be overwhelming. And I know you got two smaller ones. So that's going to be a really different kind of boat. Because I just got two small area. ones. I don't have two big ones. So I just got, I get to deal with all the good stuff when they're young. And I know that that's probably a lot on your plate. And I think it can be overwhelming. So what I would like to do is I'd like to offer you counseling. We can help with any way we can that you guys can just be a loving family, like you want, like he wants. I'd love to update the story and know if this actually helps. Does, do you think it helps help you? Counseling. We have to have counseling. OK. I, I think you do, too. So I wish you all luck in the world, man. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>